Welcome back to another episode of Ask the Doctor. Now, today's question is from Joe. And Joe asks, is eating rice or taking it in a, in a supplement bad for you? Thanks for bringing this up. Dr. M and I have been amazed by the number of questions we get on rice and the misconceptions out there. So let me share the facts with you. Whole grain rice with the germ and the bran intact, like brown rice, can be a healthy addition to your diet because it's an excellent source of many nutrients, including fiber, trace minerals like manganese and selenium, and macro minerals like magnesium and B vitamins. Now, if you're insulin resistant, or maybe you have developed prediabetes or diabetes, you definitely want to consume uh, a lot less carbohydrates, and that would include rice as well. Now, although it's a good fuel and a nutritional source, too much of any carbohydrate will elevate blood sugar levels. Some of you have asked if rice used as a filler in a supplement, if this is dangerous for diabetics, and the answer is no. The amount of rice used as a filler in supplements would be analogous to eating 10 grains of rice or less. This amount is not nearly enough to budge glucose levels or to raise your blood sugar. Now, the second question we often get on rice is, is it safe to eat rice because of the arsenic levels? Now, this is a very valid question, and in our video, Toxic Attack on Nerves, Dr. M covers this topic. Here's what you need to know. Rice plants will grow and get exposed to arsenic from the soil, irrigation water, and from farming chemicals like pesticides, and the plant does indeed absorb the arsenic. This most definitely occurs with conventional farming methods. However, it also happens with, with organic farming, but to a far lesser degree. And this is because the amount of naturally occurring arsenic in the soil. So if you're eating rice, the first thing you want to do is only buy organic whole grain rice, not white rice. Also, rice grown in California has been found to have much lower arsenic levels than anywhere else in the U.S. Next, you'll want to pre-boil the rice before you actually cook it. This will remove 70% or more of the arsenic. If you rinse it and pre-boil it a second time, you'll remove almost all of the arsenic. Now, if the rice is used as a filler in a supplement, Typically, the manufacturer will steam treat the rice to remove the arsenic. So the answer to the question is whole grain rice like brown rice, basmati rice, and forbidden rice are all healthy to eat as long as you're not insulin resistant. Rice used as a filler in a supplement is safe for diabetics or anyone that's insulin resistant because the quantity is so minute it will not create any elevation in blood sugar. We love these questions you guys throw at us because we know it's helping people out. Keep them coming. 